Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Jiu Jitsu Flow. This is a channel where we're doing body weight workouts based on Jiu Jitsu movements and techniques. Uh, today, we are lucky enough to be joined by my training partner, Walter. Uh, I brought him in today to help with the visualization of our toe line step sequences, okay? So just about every workout that we do, I like to mix in uh, at least one toe line step sequence. And the goal hopefully is by having Walter here, uh, it'll help you guys when you're doing the movements individually with the practical application of it, okay? So hopefully you guys enjoy and let's get into it. All right guys, here we go. We're gonna start first, toe line step, right foot forward. Here we go. We're stepping up to our opponent's toe line. Pretend there's a horizontal line at their feet. We don't wanna cross that line, right? As we step up, we're gonna have a plan, right? The toe line is our safety zone. If we just blindly step into our opponent's seated guard past their toes, now they have the ability to go on the offense. Shin to shin, turn, uh, turn into a, you know, Ashigrami type scenario, arm drags, different things. So we're stepping up to that toe line. Nice and balanced. We step forward, our foot goes forward. As we disengage, our back foot leads us back. Good. Here we go, left leg now. Gotta get comfortable doing both sides. Here we go, left leg's leading. Our back foot heel should be off the floor on the ball of our foot. Here we go, 10 seconds. Nice, nice, all right, now we're adding the scoop, right? The point of this, we're grabbing our opponent's ankles, scooping them onto their back. Here we go, right foot forward. This is what it's gonna look like. We step to the toe line, we grab the ankles, we scoot them to their back, then we start to engage. But for the sake of the workout, right? Right foot forward, we step to the toe line, we lower our level, we scoop, and back. Here we go. Just like when we go in for a takedown, a, a double leg, single leg, we're lowering our level. We're not bending over at the hip, right? We're squatting down. Ten seconds. Good, here we go, now we're going left leg forward. Sit up, Walter. All right. Here we go. Left leg's leading and we're scooping. So we're scooping the ankles so that we can be on the offense when our opponent, when they go to their back, right? We don't want our opponent on the bottom to be able to dictate the momentum and the pace and feel comfortable going from open guard to seated guard and us not knowing how to react, right? 
So as we scoop, we're then starting to engage and getting a great workout while doing it. Here we go. 10 seconds. Nice. All right, here we go. Toe line step, forward step. So now we're stepping into our opponent's guard. Here we go, right leg first. We step to the toe line. Now we're taking that extra step into the seated guard. Now when we want to come out of it, front foot again, and here. Here we go. Every time we engage into our opponent's seated guard, we want to make sure we have a shoulder, shoulder control, and one of the hands, right? So if our lead hand can go to the shoulder, our rear hand is controlling a wrist or a hand. Ten seconds. Good. Here we go, left side now. Toe line step, forward step, left foot. Here we go. Step into the toe line, left foot in, hand back. Now our left hand is leading, so it'll go to the shoulder. Again, we're dictating and having a plan of when we step into our opponent's seated guard, as opposed to just going in blindly and allowing our opponent to go on the offense. Here we go. Nice, guys. All right, now we're gonna create some movement. We're going toe line step, side step, right leg first. Here we go, right leg's gonna step to the toe line. We stomp, now we're gonna sidestep with the left. And we're here, all right? We can't just go into our opponent straight ahead. We wanna create some movement. So this is the first step in doing so. Nice sidestep. How's your breathing doing? Ooh. 10 seconds. Nice and controlled through all the movements. Good. Here we go, left side now. Toe line step with the left, side step with the right. Here we go, toe line step left, side step with the right. Each step is followed by a tap. The position where we're tapping, right here, we wanna be able to explode in either direction, so we gotta be on balance. When we disengage, we can stand up, but once we start to engage, we gotta be in a good, balanced fighting position. Good. 
Nice, guys. Here we go, right side. Now we're gonna do a toe line step, side step, crescent step to get around the legs. Here we go. Right foot, toe line step, left foot, side step, right foot's gonna crescent step. Shifting 90 degrees, reverse mechanics back. Again, toe line step, side step, crescent step, looking to get the foot into our opponent's hip line. Here we go. Reverse mechanics, back. If our opponent doesn't move, right, they stay facing the same way, we cross and step right into knee on belly. They're gonna most likely move, but we wanna create that movement and dictate the movement so we can react. Maybe one step ahead. Here we go, less than 10 seconds. Good. Here we go, last one, going to the left now. Toe line step left, side step right, crescent step with the left. Here we go, toe line step. Side step, crescent step. Reverse mechanics back. Last one, here we go. Let's go, more than halfway done. Ten seconds. We're in time. Hey, awesome job, guys. Hopefully this was helpful for you, right? So we're using our awesome partner, Walter, to help with the visualization of our toe line step sequences, okay? So I went through a couple today. Um, you can put a chair, you can put anything you want down to help with the visualization if, it, if it's helpful to you, or you don't need anything, just use your brain, right? And we're doing all the same movements but now you have an idea of how they're being applied, okay? So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, subscribe, like the channel, share with your friends if this is helpful for you. Uh, continue providing me feedback and hope you guys enjoy the rest of the day. Take care.